So double tops and double bottoms, okay? Right. Number one, what you should write down is double tops and double bottoms are the most powerful reversal patterns. Please write that down. Double tops and double bottoms are the most powerful reversal patterns. Okay. Double tops and double bottoms are the most powerful trade reversal patterns. Now, let's actually go through the reason why they are the most powerful trend reversal patterns or, or reversal patterns. Let's start with the double top, right? Let's say the market was going up like this. It comes back down, right? And it continues back to the upside. Number one, right? A lot of people that were buying, if they see this, what comes into their mind? Buy. So they assume trend continuation, right? So when they see this, they assume the trend is going up. And then what happens is the market will either do two things here. Very, very important. It's either the market will come and break through this level, right? And before the candle closes, it comes back down and start trending down. Or, alternatively, the market comes <coughs> and fails to break the first leg and starts going back down again. Okay. Let me actually explain it in a, in a market maker style or a bank trader style. The reason why these are very platform, uh, these are very powerful and the reason why they hold. So, when people assume trend continuation, they start buying again, right? On this level okay mm -hmm. so when they start buying on this level we know for a fact there is now stops building on this level why because this is a previous swing no. low mm -hmm. simple as that now the trend was going up and the trend starts going down this is a previous swing low we know stops are building here very very important right so when the market comes on this level something else happens again right remember what i said in the morning what is the most popular trading strategy in the world Breakout. breakouts thank you very much oh guys are paying attention <laughs> thank you so the most popular trading strategy in the world is breakout so there's two things again that will happen now when the market comes here remember what happened on gbp JPY I said hold because the market was still breaking the level, right? Mm -hmm. So essentially I was waiting for the break and close above, but the market broke before the candle closes, it was like sitting below here. Do you remember that? Mm -hmm. That's how we didn't take that trade. Unfortunately, I saw it actually started continuing and, and uh, uh, broke and closed above. So now when it comes here, now that you know the most powerful, popular trading strategy in the world is the breakout, people get faked out on this level. Does that make sense? Let me explain it again. This is very important. The trend was going up, came back down, comes and breaks this level, but before the, the candy closes, the market comes back down and closes below that level. Okay? So the people that trade break out at this stage here, they saw a trading opportunity. They what? The bought. So, this move does two most important things. Number one, it fakes out, right? Number two, it trips the breakout. Number three, it comes and takes out this flow that is here that has got stop losses. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So, that's why it's the most powerful trading uh, uh, reversal pattern because we know if people see this, they assume trend continuation. Remember your phase one, your phase two, this is anticipating a phase one. one. Yeah. Right? But you don't get that phase one because when it comes to this high, it fails or it breaks the highs and closes below. And then when it does that, 
you know with high probability the market's about to go down because it has faked the buyers. The other thing as well that you should uh, understand is how do you guys trade the breakout? Who can tell me how you trade the breakout? How do you trade the breakout? Simple guys. Can you do it on the face too? But how do you actually physically trade the breakout? What do you do when you're trading your breakout strategy? Thank you very much. We place an order. So, the other thing that we should know as well, as soon as the market starts going up here, orders are also building here. Right? We know orders are starting to build there. Because people are anticipating the break of these highs and the market continuum using the breakout trading strategies. So, it will also trigger the breakout traders in here, right? And take them into the market. But guess what it does right away? It drags them south. So there's, there's quite a lot of things that happen. That's why it's, it, it's the most powerful because one move does a lot of damage. Do you understand why? Yeah. One move does a lot of damage. One move fakes people that is going up and people start buying there when it's breaking, when it tells them closed above. Number two, it triggers breakout traders exactly like how you trade it. It triggers them into the market and finally, it actually drags everybody down and actually hit the stop losses that are, are, are on this level. Then the market keeps on going down. If you want, if you want to keep trading simple, right? This is very powerful, guys. Please go at home and back test this. Crunch the numbers. If you want a very simple trading strategy, I mean, this is the simplest ever trading strategy that we we'll ever learned today. Go on your charts, maybe go on a 15 minute chart, and just look for M's and W's only, which is your double tops and your double bottoms only. Just take the trades. If you're not lazy, please go and back test and write down the stats of how many double tops and double bottoms you found. It doesn't matter of the time frame. The guy that taught me to trade years ago said people are stupid on every time frame. I know it's not the right way of saying things, but you will find double tops on a five minute chart, 15 hourly, four hour daily, monthly. They will always be there. And with high probability, they will hold. Okay, now let's explain the double bottom. Let me tell you, what is the meaning of backtesting? Backtesting. Okay, backtesting means uh, opening your charts. Let's say you open an hourly chart since January using the past history and just look at the double tops and double bottoms and say, okay, there, was, there, there could have been a trade here, could have taken it using this double top, how much pips I could have made. You just assume so that we can get the accuracy of the trading strategy. What I'm going to do is I'm just to going, going to randomly go through the charts now so that you can see what I'm talking about. You can select any chart, any instrument. We're going to do it randomly, right? and actually go through the double tops and the double bottoms. Very powerful. That's why I'm saying it's the powerful reversal pattern. So there we go, right? And then, now, this is a double bottom or a W formation. So now, people are assuming trend, continuation number one, right? Mm -hmm. So, if they assume trend continuation on this level here, right, we've got orders to go short. Right, I just remembered something else as well. Why this pattern is very powerful. The other thing that is here as well, guys, what else is here? There's orders to short or sell. What else is here? Thank you very much. Stop losses now on this leg, right? Let's say someone got it right here and started seeing the markets going up and bought here, right? Where is their stop losses? It's here. It's to swing low, right? So now it's, it went back down, went back up. Now people that are even buying here, their stop losses are there. 
Right, but for the guys that are trending the trending the trend, what are they looking for? Trend continuation. So one move comes, takes these guys that got in here for a buy, right? Their stop losses here trigger their stop losses. Number two, fake these guys that are looking for trend continuation, right? And also fake these guys that are trading the breakout. See one move what it, what it does. Number one, trigger stops, right? Trigger stop losses. Number two, fake. B O stands for breakout traders, right? And then number three, what did we say? Fake trend continuation, right? Three things. One move does three things. And then when it fakes out here, doesn't close below, comes and starts doing this. That's how powerful this pattern is. Yes, sir. Tony, what yeah. you're telling us is it is it's almost impossible to get this trade right because it does everything opposite what you would like it to have done as a trader to make money. What do you mean? What do you mean? You gotta buy it. It means it triggers the stop loss. Yes. That you put in. And so it kicks out the trade. You don't take it on the first leg. Mm -hmm. You take it on the second leg. Okay. Remember, here you are not in. Mm -hmm. But other uniform traders, they are already in here. On the first leg. 